billionaire entrepreneur Elon Musk's brain chip startup is gearing up to launch human clinical trials. Musk, who co-founded Neuralink in 2016, promised the technology would allow a paralyzed person to use a smartphone with their mind faster than someone using their thumb. The Silicon Valley company, which has already successfully implanted artificial intelligence microchips in the brains of a macaque monkey named Pager and a pig named Gertrude, is today recruiting a clinical trials director to test the technology in humans. In today's video, we'll talk about Elon Musk's Neuralink preparation for human trials in 2022. But before that, make sure you press that red subscribe button along with that tiny bell icon to get updated every time we post new videos. Let's get started. Musk described the Neuralink chip, which measures about 23 millimeters or 0.9 inches in diameter, as a Fitbit in your skull with little wires on it, said the company's chief surgeon, Dr. Matthew McDougall. Musk, the world's richest person with an estimated fortune of $256 billion, said last month he was cautiously optimistic that implants could enable quadriplegics to walk. Humans who will be people with severe spinal cord injuries like quadriplegics next year pending FDA approval, he added. He thinks they have an opportunity with Neuralink to restore full body functionality to someone with spinal cord injury. Neuralink works well in monkeys and they actually do a lot of testing and just confirm that it's very safe and reliable and that the Neuralink device can be removed safely. Musk has previously offered earlier timelines for Neuralink to implant its chips in humans for the first time. It's said in February that Neuralink could begin implanting the technology in people by the end of 2021. After raising $205 million in July, Neuralink said it would funnel funds into developing its chip to enable quadriplegics to control digital devices with their minds. However, Musk has a habit of overpromising the speed of the company's development. In 2019, he predicted that the device would be implanted in a human skull by 2020. He said people should think of the technology as replacing faulty or missing neurons with circuits. Progress will accelerate when we have devices in humans next year, he said. Neuralink previously posted a video of a chipped monkey playing the video game Pong using only his mind. Neuralink works by recording and decoding electrical signals from the brain using more than 2,000 electrodes implanted in regions of the monkey's motor cortex that coordinate hand and arm movements, the video's voiceover says. Neuralink isn't the only company working on artificial intelligence for the brain. Entrepreneur Brian Johnson, who sold his former payments company Braintree to PayPal for $800 million, founded Kernel, a company working on advanced neural interfaces to treat disease and enhance cognition in 2016. Musk recently said that Neuralink's brain chip technology would allow people to stream music to their brains effortlessly. Musk confirmed the function in an exchange with a Twitter user who asked, if you're working on Neuralink, can we stream the music directly from our chips? Excellent functionality. Musk replied with a simple yes. He's also confirmed that the chip would be able to control hormone levels, which would have the potential to help with anxiety relief, among other things. Connecting a brain directly to electronics is nothing new. Doctors implant electrodes in the brain to provide stimulation to treat conditions such as Parkinson's disease, epilepsy, and chronic pain. In experiments, implanted sensors allowed paralyzed people to use brain signals to operate computers and move robotic arms. But Musk's proposal goes further. Neuralink wants to take advantage of these existing medical treatments as well as a day's work on surgeries that could improve cognitive functioning. So that's all for today's video. Let us know your views in the comment section below. And don't forget to like this video before leaving. Thanks for watching.